going on, people? Welcome, welcome. Hopefully y'all are doing good. Hopefully your week is starting well. Uh, let's go over to the to the live scene here. Welcome everybody. Uh, <laughs> that freaking cat always gets me. <laughs> How's everybody doing? Welcome. Um, let me know if the music is a little too loud. Probably not, but just 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 in case. Uh, today we're on Stumpy's account, and we're gonna go ahead and uh, open up some chests while we talk about whatever we usually talk about on stream. Um, and hope for some upgrades, hopefully. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. First of all, first of all, let me take a look at all the boxes. So we have quite a few. Um, we have more Frostwing and Snow Bees than anything else. But we will go through all of these and see if we can get maybe an upgrade or two. Uh, I was taking a look at his gear here. And um, there is quite a few things that he could upgrade. So we'll see. I know, for instance, the firewall plate is, like, right there. Like, right there. So, yeah. Um, what about the offhand? The mitts. Where are the mitts? Wait. Does he not have the mitts? Oh, my. He doesn't even have the mitts. Wait, wait a minute. I feel like that's something that everybody should have. Um, where are... He already has five... What do, you, what do you need in order to complete it? Is it six and change? We're almost pretty much there, so... It's not gonna be that big a deal. So we'll, we'll definitely get that. Um, what's going on? Yeah, welcome people, welcome, welcome. You spent 200 and then quit? 200, bro, I... <laughs> It's going to sound pretty bad, but I, I've spent 200 on like, in, in like a minute. That's, that, is that sad? It's probably a little sad, but just open everything. All right, all right. So first of all, we're going to go ahead and uh, start with this gold jewel right off the bat, right? Because the game likes me that way. <laughs> all right, not a great start, but a couple of blues here will make up for it. Okay one blue but um you gotta you gotta work up to it so you know what that's fine that's fine what's going on boy where's my other account um i don't i don't know it's it's out there in the world existing okay so Let's go ahead and open these up. I I am actually hoping not to get a bunch of gold items from here because I don't I don't want to blow my um, my luck on the ones that we don't necessarily need. Oh, with that being said, I noticed that in your mix set, in your mix set, there was something that was really triggering me, and that is this the horn cudgel. Um, I don't know. Why you're using the horn cudgel over the frostwing greatsword? I'm guessing that you think that your your range or your your calf is a little too low, but the horn cudgel is not worth. It's not worth it. I would definitely change it in an in an instant because um, yeah, it's not worth it. You can you can go like this, change some jewels around, and um, you'll be you'll be better off for sure, for sure, for sure. But uh, with that being said, now that we talk about that Frostwing sword thing that I noticed, let's see if we can get some more hearts. What's going on? You can't handle the constant maintenance of shields and stuff? Well, technically speaking, we don't really get a lot of maintenance shields. Um, that rarely happens, actually. So, I don't think that's that big of an issue. Um, today, today I'm going to be starting a new show. I just don't know which one I should watch. I I may actually start watching... Um, what What is that? that? That new Captain America show? What is it? Um... Falcon and the Winter Soldier? Is that how it's called? Or is it Winter Soldier and the Falcon? I think it's Falcon and the Winter Soldier. There's a gold. Oh, God. Um, 
I might start that one. Or I might start another one. I'm not sure. Does, does anybody got a show that they recently watched that you would recommend? I really am thinking about Falcon and the Winter Soldier. Uh, but, I don't know. Yeah, he has the parts for the sword already, yeah. We've pulled plenty of purples, so... Oh, having your own shield? I see what you mean. There's another gold. Oh, no. I'm getting all the golds early on. This is not good. This is not what I wanted. <laughs> this is not what I wanted. Wait. Oh, okay. Sons of Anarchy. I have heard about that. Are you kidding me? Stop, game. No. Three gold hearts. No! No, no. Oh. Have I watched Godzilla vs. Kong? I have, actually. I have. I have. Anime? It doesn't have to be anime. It could just be, just be good. Magic school bus? Okay, I mean, I've seen magic school bus. I mean. <laughs> Another purple. Oh, my God. There goes all my luck. Another purple. That's it. Fight Club? Huh. Where would I watch Fight Club? Sons of Anarchy is good. Hmm. What's, what's Sons of Anarchy about? I don't really know much about it at all. Another purple? Man. Please don't let it be the only gold set. Oh, no! That's like five. No, when you need them, you don't get them. And then, oh no, dude, that's five gold. This is not, oh. Uh, is the burning scroll really worth it though? For mixed, yes. Yes. Much better than a crappy vial or a drum. Don't ever use a vial or a drum in your mix set. Because if you do, I already know that you're trying to... Uh, um, make up for stats that you think are lacking. So if you, if you ever see somebody wear a vial or a drum in their mix it, it means that they're trying to make up for some stats and they're they're just yeah no. Do I play chess? Not really. Sons of Anarchy is really good. Really. Um. What's okay? But well, what's it about? Man, there's no other way to put this than wasted luck. You're right. It's, it's, wow, this is just rough. Man. All right, let's see if this treats me the same way. Probably not, but I'm anticipating like one or two gold bells, probably. I'm anticipating it. Man, oh man. Okay. What is the best mix gear without champion gear? The best mix gear without champion gear is for the main hand. It would be the Skull Crusher. Skull Crusher is actually pretty on par with champion main hands. For the helm, it would be the Bumble Helm. Uh, for armor, it would be the Fire Wall Plate. For the legs, uh, you can make the case between the Dragon's Talons or the uh, what the hell are the, uh, the the ones with the pearls called? Uh, shoot, I'm blanking out. What, what are they called? Do you have them? Right here, yeah. The uh, Storm Tacits. That's the name. You can you can make an argument between the two. Um, those are pro probably the best two. It just depends on what stats you're going for. But either of those, you can't really go wrong. Um, for the offhand, you can either go um, Mitz or uh, Codex. I would say Mix is probably better than the codex unless you're lacking calf and then for accessories obviously the cups are going to be the best so those are the absolute best uh non-champion for mix look at the trailer for sons of anarchy and just watch the two minute video on it where can i watch sons of anarchy though like where where can i where can i watch that going on devil there's two purples wow 
Another purple. I mean, it's raining purple at least, you know? Another purple. Man. Oh. Is it on Netflix? Oh, if it's on Netflix, then... um, Because this, this is what I have. This is what I have, okay? I have Netflix. I have Disney Plus. I have um, Prime. I have uh, HBO. The ones I don't have is Hulu. I don't I don't have a Hulu account. Um, I don't have a Peacock account. I really want to get a Peacock account just, just for The Office. Literally, I care about nothing else other than The Office. I want to be able to watch The Office. But paying... How much is Peacock? Like $10? $15? I don't want to pay an extra for that. No, man. So... Ah... Uh, I appreciate that, boy. You may find it on Netflix. Well, is it or is it not? What do you mean you may find it? I don't have a Hulu account, though, so... I, if it's on Hulu, I, I, I don't have a Hulu account. Okay, so this one's definitely not as good. I, I haven't even gotten one gold, so... Um, my the hearts took all the the luck. The office is overrated. Well, that's your opinion. You're entitled to it. Biker gangs, drugs, is sons of anarchy. Interesting concept. Sons of anarchy is a Netflix. Okay, well, if it's on Netflix, we're good. If you get Lords on PC, by the way, I feel like Mimu plays less laggy. I use LD Player. LD Player is great. Just use a VPN and watch The Office from Spanish Prime? Really? Huh. Watch this uh, legendary main right here. Oh, come on. Girl. Come here. Come here. Hi, girl. Come say hi. Come say hi. Uh. Good girl. Where you been? Hmm? You wanna say hi to them? You saying hi? What do you think? Are you looking at all the lights? Hmm? You're a good girl? <laughs> you ready to go? Hmm? Go. It's okay. Go. There you go. You're gonna jump up to your spot, are you? Okay, come on. Don't hit me with your tail, though. That's rude. D don't hit me with your tail. That's rude. God. There you go. Jump up to your spot. Go. There you go. Uh, okay, do you need this? Um, I feel like you probably do. You do. It's a purple... Oh, wait a minute. You do. You're at four and a half. All right, all right. We got to get this to gold. We got to get this to gold. A hundred percent. We got to get this to gold. Oh my god, I keep messing this up. Hello? Alright. So we need six purples, essentially. Alright. I appreciate that, boy. Yeah, she's she's one of my cats. She's the one that's uh, the, the shyest of them all. Okay. We need good drops from this worm chest because we're trying to get this to gold. Okay, I'll take the jewel, though. For sure. That's trash. Come on. Please. Why me? Come on. When you want the good drops, it doesn't it doesn't happen. Look at this. You can't be. You... Please. Look at these drops now, man. WP had a meltdown on his WoW stream? Why did he melt down? It seems to happen very often nowadays. Uh, please, come on. <laughs> this drops! Why? Come on, man. Look at these drops. Just one gold. 
Just give me one gold and maybe with the, the monstrous chest, we'll, we'll clutch it out. Oh, the, the jewel's cool, though. The jewel's cool. I know, man. It, it's like, it's so stupid. You, you want the drops, you don't get them. You don't want anything, you get all of it. Ah, uh, Jesus, dude. You started the show Queen's Gambit show last night, and it's actually pretty good. I actually watched it with one of my friends. We got up to, like, episode 3 or 4, and it was actually pretty good. Um, the I haven't really finished it, though, because I basically only, I, I was only really watching it with her. So we haven't finished it, but we, we're, like, on episode 3 or 4. It was actually good. Even though I know nothing about chess... Um, the show kind of makes it to where, even if you don't understand chess well, um, it would, it would actually make sense. So, I didn't know half of the stuff that was going on, but they explained it well. Please, please, just one go. I mean, the jewels are, the jewels are nice. 153, holy hell. Okay. <sighs> Okay, all right. Okay, let me let me let me put everything together. Hold on, hold on. We're not there yet. We're not there yet, but we're oh we're close. Oh my God, we're one purple away. Oh, we're one purple away. We're one purple away. Please, for the love of everything that's good and holy in this world, one purple away. Ah, oh, but that, you know what? That's like a blue. So that's fine. That's that's fine. That is fine. Come on, purple. Or anything to make it easier for the monstrous chest. Come on, you can do this. God damn it. <laughs> God damn it. Alright, alright. One more shot. One more shot, please. Give, give me a blue. I'll I, I'm fine with a blue. I'm fine with a blue. Alright. Well. How, how much did we still need? How much did we still need? We need... We essentially need two blues. Oh my god, that's so close. That's actually annoying. Terror chest. I saw the armor. Ooh, oh, you're not very close, are you? Mm, but we still have to make progress. If we can get to like three, three of nine or three of nine and change, that'd be great. So let's see. That's not great. I'm feeling like a good jewel is going to drop out of this too. Maybe. Hopefully. Ugh. Oh. Alright, well. Drops have been trashed right off the gate. Hmm. Alright. Come on. What I said about the jewel. I freaking felt it. And it's not a gold. It's not a gold. But damn it, that's a good jewel. Mm -mm -mm. Can you can you even use it on your inf? You probably could, huh? You definitely could. You can put it on this puppy right here. Heck yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Nice. Very nice. Very nice. What am I migrating to seven five seven? I I'm not. I am not. So, see, 757 isn't even fun anymore. Like, at what point does it stop being fun? You know what I mean? Like, now that fight is just a personal fight at this point. It's not even a fun fight. Can you imagine having a, an account rally for two weeks straight? That's stupidity at that point. Like, damn. Mm. We have, they have people on shifts on those accounts. Like, it's a job now for them. It, it's a shift. Like, you gotta clock in and out. That's that's stupidity at that point. No way. No way. No, thank you. Alright, come on, let's see. Not great. Come on, just give me one good drop. One good drop. Is that considered a good drop? A blue? Uh...
Thoughts on Tashi migrating to Worthy Prince just for a while? Um. So? What's the problem with it? Ain't no problem with it. That's why migration exists, right? So? What's the problem? Is there any issue with it? I don't get it. What do you mean, thoughts on it? It is what it is? Is there an issue with it? Oh. Thoughts on the feud between Tasha and Willie Prince? Uh, that's just... Their, their thing now is just personal at this point. Like, it's just personal at this point, so... I'll leave, I'll leave that up to them. I don't I don't really care. Uh Gargantua. Gargantua Gargantua. Ooh, you have this at gold. But you are nowhere near mythic though. So I wonder if you would rather take up the main hand or will you finish the the belt first? Hmm you need three. So let's let's just see if we can get anywhere near three. And then maybe you all at least have the the choice. You know what I mean? Hmm. I think that Tashi won a wreck Worthy Prince, but I find this childish to follow him everywhere. Tashi won that fight against Worthy Prince because he migrated out, so no need to come after him. I don't know. You say it's childish, but um it's a it's a war game. So if you're at war with somebody and they move, how is it childish to follow them? I don't understand the, the line of thinking there. Um, they t didn't, didn't TWK migrate in on Tashi's kingdom? Um, knowing that they would have backup? So then once the backup left, they migrate out themselves? So fair is fair, isn't it? They were they were all for it when they had backup, but when it wasn't with backup, then now it's childish. I don't agree with that. I don't agree with that. If you didn't want if you don't want those issues, you shouldn't have started those issues. You know what I mean? Now, now it is what it is. I mean. There, there is no denying though that they they both have uh, gotten very toxic between each other. So, I mean, Wor Worthy has like threatened physicality on Tashi. Like, at what point does it become a little like, all right, come down now? What are you talking about? Like, come on now. Two blues. You know what? If I pull a legendary jewel here. <laughs> I can't even pull that in my main account. I don't know what it is on my main account in Garg Jewels, but they just don't freaking exist. They just, they just... <sighs> Man. Please. If you're gonna give me gold, give it to me now. Okay. Not really what I was looking for, you know? Yeah, no? Hmm. You're scared of the game now. I see Kingdom 757. Um, you Okay, here's the thing though. You really shouldn't be scared. Because Kingdoms like 757 only happen like once a year. If, if that... Are you freaking kidding me? You, bro. I never get that on my account. Like ever. Ever. In the history of ever, 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 ever. Come on, man. That's just not right. Like, like, I'm happy for you, but I'm a little salty at the same time. Like, are you kidding me? Come on. Where is that in my account, game? Where is that in my account? Look at this. He even has, like, oh, wait, are these all purple? Oh, you have some blues. Okay, so you can, you can upgrade some. Okay, okay, okay. So it's mainly blues. We can, we can upgrade them some. All right, all right, all right. All right, cool deal. Man. <sighs> Yo, Big Cookie with the $5 dono. Appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you. Sorry about my insanity about 757. What do you mean insanity? Wait, what do you mean by that? Okay, see, here we go. Now we're getting some purples. Why is my phone blowing up? What's going on here? Wait a minute. 
Guys! Wait a minute. Uh, okay, okay. Um, let me just put the, let me just put this out there because I know a lot of people sometimes might get mad at me or, or something along those lines. If you ever send me a message, whether it's in game, on Discord, online chat, etc., a lot of times, like I ha I get so many notifications. Look at that, nice. I get so many notifications that I, I just I don't even like look at them most of the time. And, and when I try to go through my messages, a lot of them are just like asking me for stuff. Hey, give me gems. Hey, can you can you give me your champion item? People literally ask me to send them items. Like, that's not even how the game works. Like, wh what are you talking about? So if you ever send me like an actual message, like a useful or, or like an actual question, and I don't reply, it's not that I didn't want to reply. It's just that more than likely, I never even saw it. So don't, don't, don't get mad. Um, send it again send it again it's it's just bad like the, the 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 spam that i get is bad it's bad lou what's up man any new redemption code usually that's um on thursdays at 7 p.m eastern on facebook is where i give the uh the code so tune in for that uh, do I play Castle Clash still? No, I have not played Castle Clash in a very, very, very long time. Like, a very long time. There are very few games that I even play now. Because um, Lords Mobile is not the only game I play. It's it's not the only game I play. Um, at the moment, I'm playing Lords Mobile. I'm playing um, Warpath. I'm really enjoying Warpath. Uh, I'm also playing AFK Arena. That's an awesome game as well because you don't really have to be super active on it. It's called AFK Arena after all. Uh, and then Guns of Glory. That, those are the only four games that I really play. And the ones I play most actively is Lords and Warpath. So outside of that, Castle Clash was dropped a very long time ago. Uh, yo, Cookie with another $5. Appreciate it, man. I commented on your thread saying you were lying. Oh, oh, I do remember that. I, yeah, you were saying that I was uh, that I was lying because seven five seven wasn't uh, wasn't safe. Um, I re I remember that. I don't remember it being Big Cookie though. Was it Big Cookie? I don't remember that being the name that commented. Or maybe maybe I just misremember. I don't know. Um, no, but it, it's cool though. Uh, um, if you were not rallied, then. Um, you were either lucky or maybe they you just weren't like a high might enough target or whatever it might have been but listen 757 is not a safe kingdom so um, but yeah no worries man I appreciate it I appreciate it thank you um, so the the drums where did we end up with the drums where, where is it there we go here we go um we're at two out of three all right so not quite there yet but and then the next one was the blight ring right where's your blight ring you have one gold one could probably redo some of these jewels and you need five more all right so unless we get insane drops you probably won't be able to upgrade but if we can get like halfway there that'd be great What's the drink of the day? I just have some Pepsi. That's all I have. How you doing, Chun? Would it be better to go Garg Belt from purple to gold or get three mythic drums? Don't have any drums right now. Um, We can easily check that out. All right, so Garg Belt from purple to gold takes how much, first of all? Uh, oh my god, it takes 8 gold. That's insane. Whoo! And you get 13% cav attack. And I'm getting a call. Well, I can't answer this call right now. So I'll have to... I'll have to call her back later. Eh, well, whatever. Um, so I can already tell you that it's gonna be the drums. Because, yeah. The cost compared to the stats you get... For the belt doesn't compare to the drums uh because the drums it only takes one and you get 
what, 8% each time? No, 6%. 6 and 2, and it only costs 1. So yeah, the drums is gonna be the, your best. It's gonna be your best one for sure. It's the it's the, the drums. Yep, 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 yep. For sure the drums. Yo, Cookie with another donation. You appreciate that, Cookie. Thank you. Uh, I boosted an insane amount of troops and was a rally, so I went a little nuts. Either way, enjoy your content and want to show you some love. Thank you, appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Uh, how much did you boost? I feel like if you boosted around the 1.7 or 1.8 million, a million, ha, huh, I wish, billion might, then at that point you may, you may actually be in the sweet spot. You just, you just gotta, you just gotta um, wait your turn, if you will, <laughs> because man, oh man, what's going on, Alan? Oh, when I was making Castle Clash videos. Yo, that was so long ago. There's a purple. Castle Clash now? When was my last Castle Clash video? Probably like three years ago, maybe. Hey! Absolutely. That's a hell of a start. Okay. All right. All right. I like it. Come on. Let's see what else we get. If we can get like one more gold, that'd be great. Even a purple. Oh, by the way. Uh how many how many of you just just out of curiosity, out of curiosity, how many of you are in Florida? Or know what Publix is? Does anybody? 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 Florida? Publix? Look at these drops now all of a sudden. Come on, just one more gold. Not the right gold, but I'll, hey, I'll take the blue. Take it. Two blues. Don't mind that. Another blue. All right, that's a, that's a lot of blues. We got a purple. All right, I, I'm not even getting purples. What the hell? Jesus. One last one, baby. Let's go. Two blues again. That was a lot of blues. Holy crap. All right. Let me see where I ended up because. Hmm. Let's see. We ended up at four. That's more than half. You know what? We'll take it. If after the monstrous chest, we end up at like five. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Where's your cups, by the way? Oh, not that close. Okay. Okay. Your boost is to 1.7 bill. Wasn't rallied and my guild got scared to migrate. Um, or, or they migrate to 719 with the rest of the guild. Currently sitting at 50 million troops. Oh, okay. So, uh, first of all, thank you so much once again for the donation. I appreciate it. I will tell you this much though. Um, at 1.7 billion and 50 million troops... You're not going to survive. You're just not. Because every rally, even if you counter them, think about think about it like this. Even if you completely counter them, meaning range rally into in front, cav rally into range front. Let's just say that you magically had a, a way to change and counter every single rally. Every rally is going to do about a million uh, of your troops just because of the familiars. So even if you counter, etc., just with the familiars alone, you're it's gonna be a million troops. So when you have 90 rallies coming at you, 50 million troops is not gonna it's not gonna cut it. It's not gonna cut it. Be yeah, just just off of the familiars alone. Forget forget countering you or whatever. Just familiars alone. It'll take one million of your troops each rally. And there's 90 coming at you. 50 is not going to do it. So, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, no. You could, I mean, uh, I... You can definitely try and take them, and you'll probably do well. 
But you will, you will burn. You will burn. Uh, but if you if you want to try and take 30, 40, 50, you, you could probably do that. But, you know, at the end of the day, taking on 90 rallies, you need you need minimum like 100 million troops. Minimum. Joey, could you survive? I don't know. Like, I don't. What's your troop count? Do you have 100 million troops? Because that's what you'd need. As, as long as as long as you were ready for it, then, you know, hey, hell dried. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I think I looked this up and you weren't that close. Uh, oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, you're not very close, but, 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 but we can try to get you closer. No, yeah, yeah, you'd, um, you would, you would for sure eat quite a few rallies with 50 million troops, especially, like, I feel like, um, instead of worrying about healing so much, I would try to, like, change my formation, go inf wedge, a couple of seconds, change to range wedge, a couple of seconds, change to inf wedge, and, like, keep switching it, that way they don't blow through one of your main front lines and then absolutely destroy you because that once your front line is it's gone it's gone but if you keep swapping between both then maybe you have a better shot you'll still burn but maybe you you might take a couple more but uh yeah man it's just it's just a lot to try and take hey neko how you doing hell rider and your talent oh you know what that's i was looking at the previous one you're right, you're right. I was looking at the previous one that we uh, we opened up. Um, so for for this, what's the... I guess the scroll is the is the right one, right? Let me see, let me see. This is what happens when you try to, like, think about a couple of different things at once. All right, so we need to... Uh, it's probably not going to be... It's probably not going to be great. What's the biggest rally party I've ever taken? I haven't really been rally partied. Um, I know that um, DTF... Uh, was it DTF or was it Sugar Fam? I think they were one and the same. Uh, it was with Sugar Bane and them, right? So I guess that's DTF, right? I know DTF one time set... How many rallies was it? I think it was like 8 rallies or 10. It was like eight or ten rallies, and um, they dropped me a total of like forty million my, uh, after those ten rallies. So um, yeah, <laughs> it didn't go well for them. And that was that was when I had like, it wasn't even a lot of troops. I think I had like twenty eight million troops or something. It didn't go well for them. Yo, Spank, you got your tow truck? Oh, I saw that tire thing, man. That sucks. Ooh, nice. That's a nice brain right there. Eef. Do you live it others or alone? Are you asking if I live alone? Yes, I live alone. Hey, Avertrix, why do people run in range phalanx in WoW? Um, that's because um, when you when you take a look at how the battles are set up, range will stop and start attacking, and it pulls their infantry and their cav all the way to your range, so they have more walk time. So it becomes it becomes the uh, the best one in general. Um, that's why there's no wall there's no wall to contend with. So. Having your their infantry and their calf have to go all the way up to your range while your range is pretty much in your back now, it gives you a huge advantage. They weren't even scouting you. Oof. Are you in any of the the families? Because a lot of times, like if you're not in in the in the KW or the uh, LH side, they won't care. You know, like it, like if you're neutral, they won't they won't care. 
Appreciate that, Goldo. I remember when I used to stick with a T4, T3 comp. Oh, but that, that was a long time ago, though. That was a while ago. Um, but yeah, eventually I just I got rid of all my T3. Uh, wow. You're at zero, essentially. Oof. Oh, right off the bat, okay. Uh, but yeah, I have, um, there hasn't been many people that actually have, like, come to zero me, if you will. And I guess, I guess there's a couple of reasons why that is. Um, number one, to get me offline is one thing. To get me offline, rally me, and for me to still be offline five minutes later is almost impossible. So... <laughs> Uh, there's reason number one as to why um, you're just not you're just not gonna catch me offline like that unless you like got run into some real luck. Uh, number two, if I'm not holding any leaders and I'm going to sleep, I just shield. I don't I, like people find shielding such a like. Oh my god, you're 1.8 billion, Mike. Why are you shielding? Cause I'm gonna go to sleep and I have nothing to lose by shielding. If there's a rally and I come online, guess what? I'll break my shield, fill the rally, go back to sleep and shield. People, like, I don't understand. Like, if I'm going to sleep and I'm not holding any leaders, I'm shielding. I want to sleep. I want to get up and not be like, oh my god, did I get zero? I have, I don't, I have no problems with that. So, yeah. If I'm, all, if I'm offline but I'm unshielded, that means I'm online. So I guess I guess that's one of the biggest factors as to why I I do not make the mistakes that a lot of these people make. You know, like try to uh, you know play your shield for the longest it can go, or go offline in wrong gear and not be available, and all of these stupid mistakes that people do. That's not me. That's not me. That's a nice grim jewel, though. Let's go. Yeah, but if I'm sleeping, I'm usually shielded. Or if I'm sleeping, I'm in gear, in talents. Like, I will not make it easy for anybody. If you zero me, you went through it. Nobody's going to zero me easily. No, 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 no. No. I'm considering boosting to 90 mil and going back to 757. You are in a small guild UW plus if you want to give us a shout out. Well, there you go. UW plus um, 90 million. Hmm. You may you may have a shot with 90 million. Um, you just got to get lucky on some, but um, that's still rough. That's still rough. <coughs> uh, but yeah, uh, cookie. Appreciate it, man. Thank you. What's going on? Come here. What is it? Come here. Come. Come on. He just, he just like screamed at me and then just looked at me and walked away. It's like, what do you want? <laughs> God. Another blue. But yeah. I I still say that you still you would need minimum of a hundred million troops minimum if you're wanting to take 90 rallies. It's just oof. Um, Because okay, like I keep saying like I keep saying if you, if you really like let's just think about this if you really wanted to try and take 90 rallies, right? First of all first of all Like I mentioned the t5 familiars on each rally well, I'm, I'm just assuming that all of them have T5 familiars. Maybe some don't, you know, maybe like their weaker rallies don't. But let's just assume that they all have the T5 familiars, right? That's going to kill off somewhere in the 1 million range of your troops each rally, right? So that means 90 rallies. Minimum damage that they'll all do is 90 million troops, right? But then you're going to get countered more than a couple of times, right? Meaning if you're... Range wedge, you're gonna get hit with some range uh, or infantry rally. So you're gonna you're gonna take more than a million in a lot of these. So 
technically speaking, like if you really want to take them, you need you need to have like a 110, 120 million troops. It's just it's just how it is. It's just yeah. Yeah, you, you, you need you need a lot. You took base many times. Yeah, uh, but I, I don't know if you answer. I don't know if you answered or not. But are you part of any of the sides? Like, are you in the KW side or are you in the LH side? Um. Also, here's here's the next thing. Here's the next thing. You were in Fury, right? You were in Fury, meaning, meaning, that let's say by the, the grace of God, you survive all 90 rallies. You're in Fury. Meaning that they can rally you again. So you're not taking 90 rallies, you're taking 180. And let's just say maybe some of them can't set, right? Whatever. You're still taking like 150 rallies. Do you see where I'm going with this? Like, it's it's just rough. It's rough. You're not on any side? Okay. See, there's, there's, there's also that. There's also that. The LH and the KW side, they're trying to rally the other side to get, get rid of their troops and maybe win WoW by just a war of, of attrition, right? So they, they will win nothing by rallying somebody that's in either side. Does, does that make sense to you? Like, if two sides are warring against each other, why would they go for a third party, you know? When they can go for somebody that would actually hurt the other side. So, that's also maybe one of the reasons why they haven't rallied you. So, something to think about. What's the benefit of taking 757 base? Letting them know that you're in Fury so um, you can basically tell them, Hey! Hey! I'm ready to die now. Essentially, I mean, <laughs> not really like that, but it's pretty much um, Saber Fan. That's what I was looking for. Um, it's already up purple. Ooh, you're kind of decently close. Like, you're not close, close, but you're kind of close. Who is that? Is that you, boy? Did you hear him? What's going on? What are you crying about? You wanna go outside? It's dark. What do you want? Come here. Come here. Come on. Come here. Jump. Let's talk to the people. Come on. Come here. Alright, fine. He just, he just keeps crying. <sighs> He's an attention seeker. And now, he, now he's laying out on the floor, like, just looking at me like, Ugh, you're not playing with me. Now they have max account fillers with 2.5 bill. Uh, I'm like, yeah, it's, it's, it's insane. It's insane. Yeah. Do I know any Spanish? Uh, Spanish is actually my first language. English is, is not my first language. I learned English when I was... I want to say... I started learning English when I was maybe... Seven or so. Six or seven. Seven. Somewhere around there. Somewhere around there. Um, I'm sure you guys... Can hear the accent. I, English is not my first language. No. Oh, nice jewel and bloodsucker. Not bad. I mean, it's only blues, but hey, when you get both, not bad. All right. Dun, 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 Another blue. Uh, can I get a gold? 
Take a gold jewel. Man, half for like a split second, I thought that the, the bloodsucker was gold. Uh, oh, Big Cookie with another donation. Yo, I appreciate that so much. Thank you, thank you. Uh, no, I, I I didn't really find malice in the message. It was just, um, it, it was just, I, I was like, how how can you say that it's not dangerous when it's it's clear that it's it's not for everybody? But I, I understand what you're saying, and I get it. I appreciate it. Say something in Spanish, bro. Uh... When you say when you say that like say something in Spanish or something like it's it's such a a spot to put somebody because what the hell do you even say like <laughs> what all right those drops were not that great let me see what the actual damage watch so let's see let me see Oh man, that wasn't good. That could have been much better. Blackwing. That's the one that was at zero, right? Okay, so now we actually got to the Blackwing this time. All right. All right, all right, all right. Blue. There's got to be at least a gold here. The these drops fairly common. Let's go. <laughs> I'm jinxing myself, man. Are you kidding me? Three blue? Okay, you know what? It's not bad. Another blue? Hmm. Another blue? Alright, this is kind of like blue's clues. Hello? What's that? Like a streak of five in a row with blues? Maybe more? And there it goes. What about my older account? What older account? What? From which country am I? I'm from Dominican Republic. I am Dominican. Another blue, okay. Can we get anything other than blue? Of course you give me green. I was hoping for higher. Uh, Argentina, ooh, okay. You were born in the USA, but mom and dad are Colombian. All right, so basically you're a Colombian, right? I mean, you were born in the US, yes, but you grew up in a Colombian household. So you're you're basically Colombian, but I mean, you know. That's a nice drop though, purple, finally. Can I get that gold? Two blues. Ah. <laughs> <sighs> Two blues. How many blues have I gotten? 13. My god. Hmm. That's a gold plus off of just commons. That's really good. Holy hell. Alright, let's see. Uh, did I learn English in school? Um. I guess you could say that. What the heck? I guess you could say that I guess technically I did. But if we're being very literal about it, I most of my English I learned from uh, Cartoon Network. I think we were talking about that briefly on my last live stream. Um, I started watching Cartoon Network when I first got uh, to North Carolina, which is um, when I when I first came to the states, and I would watch shows like Dexter's Lab, Courage the Cowardly Dog, um, Johnny Bravo. Hey, mama. <laughs> What else? Um, Powerpuff Girls, Scooby-Doo, you know, all of those shows back in Cartoon Network, those are the things that I used to watch the most, and I picked up most of my English from there. Obviously, you polish it in school and all that, but it was, it was mainly there that I picked up on a lot of things. Gargantua. This is, okay, this one's actually really important, because I need two gold. Oh, two gold out of a thousand seven hundred. I don't know. I think we we will need at least a gold drop if we have a any sort of shot for this. Any sort of shot. Oh man. Yo, Cookie, appreciate it. Good night, man. And of course, appreciate it. Thank you so much. Thank you for uh, stopping by and uh, and letting me know. 
Because I, I definitely remember. I was like, wait, what? So, but yeah, appreciate it. 12 blueprints? And they're all commons. You, you can't make this stuff up. Wow. What about Ben 10? I did watch Ben 10, but to be honest, I didn't really watch Ben 10, like, a lot. I caught some episodes here and there, but I didn't, like, religiously watch it. Back then, the things that I would religiously watch was Dragon Ball Z, uh, Gundam, um, Zoids, Yu-Gi-Oh! What else? Um, I think those were the biggest ones. Those were the biggest ones at the time. Yeah. Pokemon, but... Pokemon, like, the first season of Pokemon was cool. After that, it kinda... It kinda sucked. I mean, the dude is still 10 years old today. So... But the first season of Pokemon, when it was, like, red hot, when the cards were hot, the games were... Everybody was talking about the games, all of that. I think at the time, when Pokemon was first, like, super hot... I was living in Italy, actually. Uh, yeah, so that's when I really got into all of that. That's a nice purple, though. We need more of that. We need more of that. Blue. That's fine. Come on, give me a gold. Blues. Blues are okay. We're also kind of accumulating quite a few commons. So... Dang. By the way, have you guys seen the more mature Pokemon? Um, I wouldn't call it Pokemon anime. But in the, in the Pokemon YouTube channel, they were releasing this like short clips. It, it ranged anywhere from like a minute to five minutes of like Pokemon animation from the previous games that did not revolve around ash and they were more mature and let me tell you if they made a whole anime like that i'd be so on board with pokemon again but the problem here is is that they're trying to cater to like kids so obviously you know like you still got pikachu you still have ash eh. but yo th those short clips that they released they were really entertaining like really entertaining I would be so on board with it again if they did that again, but... Eh. Eh. Do I know Italian? No, I only lived in Italy for a year. I didn't... I, I wasn't there nearly long enough to learn any Italian. I mean, I learned Italian, but, you know, it's been so long at this point that I... I don't remember any of it, or at least most of it. Eh. You had the biggest deck of Pokemon cards. Oh, my God, yo. Back then, everybody had the Charizard. Like, I know now it's like this big rare thing. But back then, everybody had Charizard. Um, everybody had a deck of cards. Hell, even when you went to McDonald's and you got like a Happy Meal or something, they would give you like five or ten cards. Yo, Pokemon was red hot back then. Like, red hot. Spank, okay, come on. You know, you know, you know what I'm talking about. God. Two more blues. Okay, damn. Best Pokemon X, Y, and Z? Uh, I'd have to disagree there. The game was actually really easy. Um, I did enjoy them, though. I, I don't, I, I would not put them as the best. But of course, that's... Wow, two purples. Let's go. Um, of course, you know, that that's an opinion. You're not going to be wrong or right when it comes to picking your favorite. Um, look at that. We already have enough. What the heck? Wow, we already have enough. Oh, okay. Literally just. Ooh. Nice. So now we're looking for jewels, right? And actually, the main hand... You, he could use the main hand. Uh, which he has not built. Yeah. MTG? Wait, what's MTG? I don't know that abbreviation. You'd have to spell it out for me. Because I, I probably know what it is, but like MTG... 
I'm blanking out on what is what is MTG? MTG. Ah. Uh, what the hell is MTG? I don't know. I don't know. More blues. Let's go. Oh, that's a bad one. All right, my absolute least favorite chest, the B chest. You're probably working on the... Ooh, hello. Wait, if you had it at gold, does that mean that you're not trying to work on the helm? You're trying to work on the armor? Oh, you are. But if you're going to be working on this chest, then... You... Yeah, you probably shouldn't work on the armor. Magic the Gathering. Okay, 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 okay. I know. I, okay, I know of Magic the Gathering. I never really played it much, so I'm not very knowledgeable on that. But uh, yeah, I know Magic the Gathering was. Um, I would say was huge, but I guess it, it still kind of is pretty big, huh? It's. I guess it still is pretty big. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, let's see. Ugh. Yo, Queen B, why is this chest still available in the game? It's so trash. I never get anything decent from these chests. I don't get it, man. I don't get it. Ugh. Jeez. It's so bad. Oh. A blue... Look at the, look, just look at these drops. It's so bad. It's actually so bad. Blue. 25 years? Holy. Okay, then. Okay, then. Uh, on your new kingdom account, I heard you wanted to make it a solo trap. Yes, it's... Um, I, I have enough already to get it to T4. Um, uh, I, I haven't really decided on the, um, on the build yet. I know that, uh, my heroes are almost pretty much done. I just need a couple, a couple of others, uh, that I have purple to get to gold. And that account is pretty much gonna be done. I'll just need to stack troops on it. But, look, B, it's it's so trash, man. Look at this. It's so bad. Ugh, it's so bad. Yo, 25 years though. That's insane. 10k. Okay. Boy. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come on. Come on. Jump. Yeah. Are you gonna tell the people why you've been so, such a, a chatter, huh? Why are you mad? What's going on? Hmm? Are you mad that I'm not playing with you? Oh, you gonna give me the don't talk to me hand? Okay. When I'm done with the stream, we can play, okay? Okay? Matter of fact, here. Look. You want me to throw it? Here. Go get it. There you go. Go get it. Go. Okay. Or just stay there, that's fine. Boy. You gonna go get it? Okay, stay there. That's fine. Bon Appetit. Alright. Uh, I think you weren't very close, were you? You were at 3 of 13. Maybe 3.5? Almost 3.5. Alright. Let's see. Oof. That's rough. Ooh. Where's my main? Um, sitting in the kingdom? I mean, accounts don't disappear. 
Am I still taking care of the cat colony? I am, actually. I fed them yesterday. I fed them yesterday. Green. It's so bad, man. <laughs> now he's playing around with that little thing I threw. You're so funny. <laughs> he's playing soccer with it now. <laughs> He like bats it to one side and then he gets it himself and he bats it the other way. So funny. Come on, give me a gold halo. Ugh. Adopt them? Listen, it's it's like 10 or 15 cats. I can't I'm already I'm already at my max capacity with three cats. Matter of fact, okay, matter of fact, let me put it to you this way. Right now, I have three cats. There are three cats that come around my place that I leave food and water outside for, which I see basically daily. I always see them outside. I leave them food, and they pretty much know that they can come and get some food outside of my house. So I have three cats that I take care of inside, three cats that I leave food and water outside of my place, and those are the ones that I see. Who knows how many that come and sneak in and get food and leave. And then there's 10 or 15 more that I go to feed in that, that, that black kitty colony. So, yeah. Uh, it's like I'm taking care of like 25 cats. So, yeah. I don't think adopting is uh, it's an option. <laughs> Do I think that way you can take 90 rallies? Oh, of course. It's not that, isn't that do like 90 or 9 billion? He'll he'll take 300 rallies. But uh yeah, I'm I'm already uh, kitted out if you will. Uh does CAE have family guilds or only allies? We have family guilds. Blue, nice. Uh as far as CAE, um we do have a family. We are, we are actually trying to recruit more... Oh, nice purple halo. We're actually trying to recruit more guilds to join the family. Um, but we just have to fight the... We have to find the right type of guild because... Uh, different guilds have different, you know, visions and things they do. Um, so, you have to find people that actually uh, would mesh well. And um, CAE is always recruiting as well. So if you're looking for a guild, you're T5, have sigils, etc. Um, CAE does have a couple of spots open at the moment. I think last I checked, we had like four or five spots. So, uh, yeah. Also, also, we were looking for a reliable kingdom where we can get forts every time uh, they're up. We don't care about the base, obviously, but forts for the, uh, for the stat bonuses... Um, cause we, we did have a deal with, uh, with a guild where we would pay gems for each fort, etc. And we would, we would kind of like split it between the guild and whatnot. But, um, now, now we need another kingdom or another guild that can provide forts. So if you know of a guild or a kingdom or something that can help us out with that, send them my way. That way we can work something out. That way we can have our forts. And we can give them gems or however it is that they might they might want to do it. Uh, we're we're down for that because having forts is it's it's very very important. So uh, if you know of anybody, send them my way because uh, I would love to have something like that long term. Uh, let me see. So we got to four out of thirteen, which uh, I mean it's something I guess. Now. Let's see. So you're not very, not very far here either. All right. All right. Give me one gold. You have a kingdom. How much gems, sir? Um. Well, that's negotiable. That's negotiable. Um, it, it depends how they want to do it. Whether they want to split it between members, um, or how they, they they would prefer the gifting, but uh, that's that's negotiable. If it's long term, even better. Um, but yeah, just just send me a message and uh, we can set something up. 
because as far as the gifting, etc., that's not a that's not a big deal. I'm sure that my guild will be able to uh, to cheap in uh, that way. Uh, it doesn't fall on just one person. But send me a message. Send me a message, and uh, we can talk about the uh, the details and whatnot. If you need people, um, you know, just let me know. Hmm. Because I, I know a lot of guilds out there that rule a kingdom and they take the forts, but they don't really fight or anything like that. They go days without hitting anything. So, as long as you take the base and have titles and whatnot, the forts is not really doing much for you. So, you might as well um, get some gems for it while you still can, you know? Because the base is what's really going to be important for guilds that aren't fighting like every day or anything like that. We've gotten a couple of good purple drops. Still looking for that gold. Blue? Okay. Ah, man. Mm. Come on. Ah. Lord with the ten dollar dono, my donation to the cat colony. Yeah, I appreciate that, man. Um, ten dollars actually gets me a bag of the. How many pounds is it? I think it's, it's like fifteen or twenty pound bag of food, which uh, definitely goes a long way. So I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Uh, yeah, that that gets me a whole like fifteen or twenty pound bag of food. That helps a lot. So thank you, thank you so much. Oh, now that we're talking about the cat colony yesterday, when I went to feed them, as I was leaving, there was two raccoons that came out of nowhere, and they were just chilling with the cats. I think I mentioned it before on like one of my videos, or was it on my Snapchat? I don't remember. But there were like two big raccoons. It wasn't like babies or anything. There were two big raccoons just chilling with the cats, like just chilling with them. I was like. What? They were just chilling. They were eating the cat food as well. So I don't know. It's because they just have nothing else to eat or what it was. But it seems like they eat some of the cat food that people leave there. They get the water from there. And they were chilling with the cats. I was like, what the? <laughs> oh. <laughs> you want now for KVK? Uh, well, for KVK, it won't work because once KVK is uh, is on, the forts open up. So it doesn't matter for KVK. It'll it'll just be for whenever the forts are going to be locked. Because um, once once KVK starts, remember the, the forts open up, so it will be no use for KVK. All right, we can get some decent amount of gems here. Let's do this. Oh, uh, that was like, what, like 10,000 gems? Uh, it could have been better. It definitely could have been better. All right, let's see what the damage was here. Oof. Um, okay, so what were the ones that I was super close to? I know the orbs for sure. I needed like just a couple of good orbs. What about here? We're not that close here. We are... Oh, he's not really working on the helm, though, so... What were some of the ones that were super close? Was this close? Not super close. Oh, the brains. That's right, the brains. Where did I get on the brains? One and a half. Okay. Have you named any of the cats that I feed? Yes. Um, the gray one that comes around at my house, her name is Lady. Uh, the, the black and white one that comes around in my house that has been coming here for years at this point. His name is Mr. Tomcat. And then there's another black and white one that I haven't really named yet. Uh, he's only been around for probably like a, like a month or two. I haven't really named them. Uh, but I, the ones in the colony I haven't named because... First of all, they all look around the same, and there's like 15 of them, 
So it's got a name. It's kind of hard to name like 10 black kitties that all look the same. Uh, that'll, that'll be rough. Um, but the ones that are here, yes, I've, I've named two of them. One of them I haven't. Okay, monstrous chest. You know what we need. We, you know what we need. We're going to do 69 and then we'll go 50 by 50. <sighs> we need orbs. We mainly need orbs. We need some brains. We, of course, need halos. Always need halos. All right. Let's see. Okay, a blue orb. That's great. Blue halo, a green orb. Nine orbs. Oh, yo, this is looking good. This is looking good. All right. Why not Tashi migrate to 757? I'm pretty sure that he did. I'm pretty sure that he did. I don't know if he got Fury, but I'm pretty sure he did migrate to 757. Uh, it was a short stay, if I remember right, but I did see him there for a short time. When I was following like all the rallies and stuff, I did see him by the base. Alright, let's see. Okay, a purple brain, let's go! Ooh, two blue orbs. I think that's literally all I needed. I think I'm good with the orbs. <gasps> I think I'm good. Yes! Alright, alright. So the orbs are good. Okay. I guess technically it's not because you still need Mythic. But don't worry about Mythic right now. Just worry about the gold. You know, Mythic will come with time. So you got that to gold. That's great. You can get this to Mythic. Um, that's your call, though, if you want to do that. Um, I would love to get this up to Mythic. That way you can change it from your uh, mix set. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Come on, baby. Now, now I need brains. Now I need brains. Okay, the Venom's actually not bad. Okay, all right, all right. Where's Warpath combat video? Well, at the moment, there's not really much combat, so I, you know. Come on. Two blue. Okay. Yo, this is actually... This is actually looking really good. Um, where's the scroll? How much do I still need? So we are at, oh, I still need like a gold drop. A gold drop or three purples. Oh, that's not looking very likely unless I get really lucky. Hmm. Okay. All right, we're making a dent, we're making a dent. Hmm. Okay, a blue. Keep on denting it. I love halos. I love everything, really, because I'm pretty sure he still needs most of this, so. It's better to buy an account than create an account, because we are poor. I... I get where you're coming from. I get where you're coming from. But see, I'm the type of person, especially now with my account, right? I'm the type of person that, like, I like to look at myself where I was, I don't know, seven months ago. And then I like to look at where I'm at today. Like, if I if I buy an account that's, like, full Mythic Champ, etc., it's great. Probably gonna be cheaper. Probably not even probably. It, it, it will be. But there is there's like a an extra sense of pride when you know that you build your account from scratch to see where it's at, rather than just magically pop up with a maxed one. You know what I mean? Um, so I mean I get where you're coming from, but it's it's not for everybody essentially. And plus, obviously. There's always that risk. Whenever you buy an account, there's always a risk. I mean, I get it, middleman and blah, blah, blah. But listen, there's always a risk. So, yeah. Yeah. Come on, baby. Let me go ahead and just get that, that gold brain. Um, I mean, it's not... Uh, I'll take it, I guess. Yeah, I mean, eh, eh. Guys, if you take a look at my account, 
seven months ago it's it's such a huge difference matter of fact matter of fact i want to let me see if i can go back six months just to see like what the hell i was doing six months ago right let's see let's see Um, uh, okay, there's a stream. Let me see if I have, like, if I show my gear somewhere. Do I show my gear anywhere? Oh, 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 wait a minute. Okay. Where is it? Look at this, look at this. I had, in my mix set, I was using a mythic scroll. I had no mythic champion item. Nothing. Nothing. The the highest champion piece that I had was a blue the blue champion legs. That was that was the best that I had. So yeah. You you if you take a look at it now, in just six months I've come that that far away. You know? <clears throat> oh my goodness. All right. Um, hmm. I'm literally going to need a gold drop in order to finish. Man. That's not bad, actually. That's real good. Wow. Okay. Yeah, yeah. The journey is really uh, awesome as well. And that's it. Okay, so... We got really close on a lot of... A lot of them. Um, you can upgrade quite a few things. I don't know what you're gonna go for. So I guess I'll leave that up to you um, Let's open the rest of these and see fortune chest. We'll leave that for last. All right, let's see Okay, not bad Wow, okay shaman chest these are always nice nice would you ever consider getting 111k after you get your faves? Maybe, but that's that's a big maybe. Uh, 11k is oof. Uh, how far am I from the three faves? Um, I'm gonna have my first mythic faith. I wanna say in a in about a month I'll have my first mythic faith. If I was to guesstimate, about a month, I'll have my first mythic faith. Kevin, what's up, man? G give me a gold. Give me a gold. Uh, chest of Splendor. We can get 100k off of this. And well, that's still quite a bit, though. Um, Yeah, that was like 20k. 20, 30k, something like that. Alright, let's see. One rare keystone. Not great. We're gonna get a gold. I mean, we did get a gold. Uh, Steam Path Chest. Uh, I hear that the drop rates are actually fairly good on this. Case in point. There's a gold core right there. Okay, 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 okay. All right, all right. We got a couple more. Not great.
Okay, the cores definitely let me down on that. Hood claw chest. I have heard that the drop rates on this are terrible. Case in point. You got capped. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, man. Oof. No bueno. Cottage roar. All right. Uh, gorilla. Not great. Showdown. These these are like whatever chests. Gold labor. What's in here? Oh, these are not not the great ones. Ember chests. I want to get at least one or two gold. If we don't, it's not us. It's them. Okay. All right. That's not bad. That uh, that's not bad actually. You may have enough to take up the armor and the sword. Now that I'm looking at it, I think you actually do. You have 11. It takes 7 for the firewall plate. And then this takes 3. Oh, dude, you can take both up. That's really good. That I would suggest it. I would suggest it. Hmm. Stars are more valuable than 11k. I would agree. Yes. Um, the right stars, anyway. The right stars. Okay, so... Where, where do we end up here? A hundred and how many? 132. Alright, so let's use this up and see. Let's see. 95. Ah... Uh, 10k times 2. Okay. Uh, not great. Not great. We need 100ks. Decent energy, though. Hmm. 60. That, ooh, that's a good, like, almost 100k just off of that. Huh. If I had to pick... One 11k, which one would you choose? Probably Lightweaver. Um, yeah, probably Lightweaver. Ah, man. Okay, so let's see where we're at with this. So from 132, we went up to 334. So that was up like 200k. Which is not bad. See you later, Kevin. Oh, what is this? Oh, the everlasting treasure. Okay. So. Hmm. Here's, here's, there's a couple of things. Um, Stumpy, it, it, can I change a couple of things that I, when I first logged in, I took a look at and I was like, I, I would definitely change that. Uh, is that, is that allowed? Can I, can I do that? Uh, unless you don't want me to. That's that's completely fine. I mean. Go ahead and change that. Nice. 25 times 11. Okay. That ain't bad. Alright. Give me my free halo. Okay. Uh... You got one hour left on your uh, on your shield, by the way. In color, Lightweaver is insane. Yeah, she's pretty good. She's pre she's probably the best out of all of them in Colosseum. Yeah, but it's not even about Colosseum. It's just that she's infantry and ranged, and um, th those that would go very well. Drink of the day is just some some uh, some Pepsi from a two liter that I got earlier. It's okay. It's still an hour. The stream is pretty much over. Do you want to open the Saint chest? I don't know if you uh where you're at with your Saint chest. You got the cloth. Um. You have gotten pretty much everything. So, huh. yeah, yeah. 
Yo, stump it with the donation. Appreciate it. Do whatever you want. All right. So, first of all, let's open these chests. We're going to do five because out of these five, we're going to get 15. 15. Oh, dude, that was one. Oh, I was one off. One off. Wow. All right. Okay. 100 chests. If we were to play the law of averages, I want to get around 300. Out of every 100, I want to get 300. I'm, I'm out of 100 chests. I want to get around 300. That's average. If I get below that, that sucks. If I get more, even better. So let's do it, baby. 300 is the goal. Oh, no, 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 no. All right. So this time we're going to get 350 to make up for it. Here we go. Here we go. Come on, baby. Oh, it's, it's averaging out. It's averaging out. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Uh, okay, all right, all right. All right, we just need like another 320 something to average it out. We need that again. We need that again. Okay, one more. Just, all right. Let's do it. 340. Oh, all right. So, I mean, it averaged like 2.8, which, okay. No, it's not terrible. It's not terrible. It's not terrible. So, now you're at 1,045. Now, you got you got options now. You got options. Okay. So, the first thing that I was looking at, your calf looks great. That's fine. Uh, familiar, there's only one familiar. So, I don't know. Monster looks great. Gather looks great. Wait, which ones are used for this usually? Uh, I guess that one. Oh, wouldn't gather. Yeah, you want you want Griffin's talent for your gather because the army capacity is plus twenty five percent, meaning that you can actually. Yeah, but honestly, I don't think that's that big a deal. Um, I'll I'll let you. What is range-ish? First of all. Yeah. You should be jeweling this. Not not that. I would move those jewels. Yeah. Inf. Looks good. Okay, but the big one, the big one, the big one was this one. The mix, you you definitely want to use the Frostwing Greatsword for the mix. Um, the jewels you can kind of play around with and change a little bit, but yeah, this one for the mix is, is no bueno. It's no bueno. This this is what you want for mix. So let's, let's go ahead and, and, and set that in. Um, obviously, you need to rejewel a bit, but yeah, yeah, that's just, that's just going to be the best thing. The other thing that I saw was your heroes. I took a look at your station, and there's a couple of things that I noticed. Because um, I thought maybe you, did, you just didn't have the options. Um, for for your range hero, you have a Tracker, which is, is a good range hero. Range attack and range defense. But there's no way that Tracker should be in here over Petit Devil. Because Petit Devil brings range attack and range HP. Which is definitely better than Tracker. So that was number one. Number two, you have um, Soul Forger for infantry. Which again, is a good infantry hero. But you have a better option. You have infantry attack from Soul Forger. But when you have... Um, where, 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 where is the dude? Ah, here he is. When you have Oathkeeper, which is infantry attack and infantry HP. 100% should be over that. And then the other thing that I noticed, um, you have Child of Light in here, which is one of the best cavalry heroes, but you don't have Rose Knight, which gives you army attack. So either, either you take out 
um, Child of Light for Rose Knight because it will help you more. And you want to keep two range heroes, two infantry heroes, and one cav. If that one cav hero, it'll have to be Rose Knight. So unless you want to change something here, this is going to be your best setup right there. So yeah, there's nothing there's nothing wrong with Child of Light because like I said, it's definitely one of the better cavalry heroes. But when you're only using one cavalry hero, Rose Knight's going to be the best one just because of the cavalry attack, not the cavalry attack, the um the uh, army attack. So let's confirm that. That's, that's, that's better. That's better. Um, this looks good. Yeah, those are your best familiars. You look, you're looking good. You're looking good. Uh, outside of that, looks solid. Looked at your comp. You have a little too much T1 for my liking, but it's, it's not like, oh my god, you have so much T1. So, it's, that, it's okay. Uh, and then of course, like I said, with the jewels, you'll, you'll have to rejewel a little bit. Um... But yeah, if you if you take this up to mythic, and then the the sword to mythic, your mix set is gonna be looking rather sexy. Where's your mix set? Right here. Yeah. Yeah, for sure, for sure. Um. You can make whatever changes you want. You can also go over troops and battalion. Okay, perfect, perfect. All right, so your troops, your troops. I don't know how you ended up with a million T1 Siege. Um, but you really shouldn't delete it. Because um, you're probably going to be needing Siege throughout. Like playing. So, But I feel like your T1 count is a little too high. Like you have like 2 million T1. That's, that's a bit too much. You will never use that many T1s. I would lower that a bit because it, it makes you easier to burn. Because that would be your front line, essentially. Because remember, your, your lower tier ones are the ones that die first. And that would be your T1. So, I would lower your T1 count by quite a bit. Um, T2 looks okay. You could definitely use some more, but everybody could use some more. So, I mean, that's fine. Try to get them to like 3 million each. And you, you're still good. T3, I don't ever suggest the... T3, but since you don't really have a lot, it's fine. Um, just don't, like, if you, if they die or whatever, just don't retrain them back up. Like, just, you can lose them over time. That's fine. It's really not a lot, so it's fine. And then your T4, um, it's fine. It's it's good. Uh, especially if you're not, like, in a really big kingdom. This is okay. Maybe try to get it to a million each. Uh, as a matter of fact, let me take a look at this kingdom. Oh, never mind. This kingdom is very small. Um, yeah, yeah, I mean, this kingdom is actually really small. You have some very, like, decent people that could rally you, but the guilds here don't seem to be, like, a huge threat to, like, double you or whatever. So, yeah, when you look at the kingdom size, you, it, it's not too terrible. Just don't get caught offline. I mean, but that goes for everybody. Um, okay, and then you said your battalions, right? Let me take a look. T4 mix. What is that? Wait. The troops are fine. I'm just trying to understand the heroes. Is this like your... Like what you would hit somebody with? Or, I don't understand the, the point of this battalion. Can you, because I don't want to change it unless I know, like, what you're going for here. I don't, I don't understand it. Is this just for, like, filling rallies? Because if so, you don't need heroes or familiars or anything like that. It's unnecessary. I don't know. I'm confused about that one. Showdown. I'm guessing this is Ka for showdown. Uh, wait, wait a minute. Here's something that I would suggest. Um, you don't need, you don't need Sage of Storm, because you already have your four cap heroes. You have Rose Knight, you have Child of Light, etc. So, because you don't have much better option, I would use Bomb and Goblin, 
because you would actually uh, benefit from the army attack more than the defense than the Sage of Storm would provide. So this this would actually be the better lineup. Even though um, bombing is ranged, you only need four calves, so it's completely fine. So, mostly for farming. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, so, in. I'm seeing something that I don't like. Yeah, all your battalions have no leader. Yeah, all your battalions have no leader. You, you can't hit anybody quickly if your leader is always different on your battalion. So, I need to change this. I, I need to change this. Okay, first of all, first of all, is bombing going to be your permanent leader? Because if bombing is going to be your permanent, permanent leader, I need to make changes right now. So if bombing is going to be your permanent leader, I can change it right now. I just need I just need to know. Because those battalions are pretty much useless. Because you don't have leaders in any of them. You'll have to swap your leader every time. And what's the point of battalions? And if you have to, you know, spend all that time changing your leader. You can change leaders. No, I don't want to change leaders. That's the whole point. I don't want to change leaders. Neither should you. Neither should you. All your battalions are leaderless, and that defeats the purpose of them. So if if new okay, perfect. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go ahead and redo all of your battalions to the best one. For that, unfortunately, we will need a size boost. So I'm sorry for using your five thousand gems, but um, it's necessary. All right. First of all, inf. This is a decent lineup, but. We need to get rid of uh, Shade. He is absolutely terrible. Hello? Thank you. Um, so now we'll go ahead and throw him in there. Again, in your in your blast, you only need four of that specific blast. So bombing is great here. Um, you don't need that. You don't need this. You don't need this. This is what you're going to need. Four. What is this? Inf? Okay. Four, four, four. That's all you need. That is all you need. Um, if you want some buffer on your T4, you could probably throw like a couple of gladiators. It's up to you though. I mean, I don't know if you want some buffer on your on your hits or if you want pure T4. Um, but yeah, you, you do not want to keep changing leads because one is inf, one is cav, blah, blah, blah. You don't want to do that ever, ever, ever. That's the easiest way to send a march leaderless without you without you realizing so um do you want to have some buffer on your hits or not it'll probably be smarter to put t3 buffer that way you can actually start getting rid of them matter of fact i will do that i will do that that way you can get rid of your t3 but remember once you run out of t3 change your battalion to reflect that so this is what i would suggest this is what i would suggest Okay, inf, done. Range. No, 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 no. Um, what would be the worst one? Defense, HP, attack. Ooh. This is a tough one, actually. Hmm. What are your familiars again? The stacking one. So, having more HP... Might not actually be the best thing. So I am going to go ahead and take out... Um, I'm going to take out Black Crow. Because that would trigger your... Um, your familiars faster. Um, you only need four. This is range, right? So four. Four. And then the rest... Oops. And then the rest for range... You put buffer. Ooh. There we go. Got some T3 buffers. Perfect. Done. T3 mixed. Uh, I'm guessing this is for filling, so I'll, I'll... Why do you have siege? What? No, 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 no. 
you don't you don't ever want to send siege first of all that's going to slow down your march and second of all i don't think people will want you sending them siege unless they say specifically so let's keep it at 100 100 100 yeah 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 cav same thing here get rid of this um don't need any of that or that or then you want the buffer and perfect okay cav done and then t4 i i still don't know exactly what this is specifically for but let's just say that this is just like a mixed march that you're sending right let's just let's just 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 go with it right um, your heroes are, are just way off. So let's go like your wall. Um, and you wanted two infantry, two range, and one calf, right? So I still need to put in... There you go. Um, yeah. Un unless you want this specifically to be uh, leaderless, but... If it's darkness filling, even if you have your leader in there, it don't matter. So it's it's fine. Yeah, so you'll be fine. Um, there we go. Yeah, because even if you have your leader and all of that, once if it's for darkness filling, it, it's not gonna send your leader obviously to the darkness. So it'll still work. All right. All right. So showdown. I don't know what this is. Because this is just calves. So now, instead of using showdown, you can just put calf. Right? Because your calf battalion is set. So you don't need showdown. So instead of having showdown, what you could do, especially if you farm a lot, this is what, and this is what I like to do, I would put, like, farming, right? Put farming and um, put repti reptilian riders. Just... 300k without an army boost it'll be 200k and then essentially if you are gonna go farming a castle whatever you just go here and i don't know just click up jesus they're all our castles uh, hello 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 dead castle anywhere oh my god all right this is all right where are we at there we go so let's say you run into a castle and you want to farm it right so you just click on attack farm and that's it you're sending 200k i get now 300k but it will usually be 200k t2 that not only is it going to be moving fast it'll get your resources come back and um, you don't have to worry about anything else so you have a farming battalion now okay so we have t4 farming inf range t3 mix i don't know why this is a thing but um i we did fix that already Cav and then battalion four. I guess this is not even used, so I guess uh, we'll, we'll just leave that be because you have everything you have your mix, you have your inf range, cav, um, farming. Yeah, so we're good. T4 mix will be for dragon arena, T3 mix is darkness. Oh, okay, yeah, so we're good. Yeah. I feel confident about that. Anybody else disagrees? Um, I, I do have a question though. What do you mean T3 in darkness? Why wouldn't you not send T4? I'm a bit confused on that one. In darkness, they're not going to die. So, like, what you could do for darkness is send all T4. Like, if you're going to send full imp, right? Send 249,000 infantry and then a thousand T3 infantry. That way, the small amount of troops that even die, even though it's not much, but that small amount of troops that die is your T3, not your T4. But you don't, you don't need to be sending T3 to darkness. They don't actually die. So, yeah, I, I think your T3 battalion you can just get rid of completely. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Walmart. I don't think he'll be using much Walmart, so I don't. I don't. I don't think that. Uh, so I think he has f two battalions that are free, 
right now. So, um, but yeah, anything else, Stumpy? Before uh, before we we sign off, anything else you wanted to check or double check or whatever? Um, I think everything else was fine. Chain check range battalion. I think I changed that one, didn't I? Yeah, I, I fixed that. It's fine. Yeah, it's fine. Range is fine. I mean, unless I'm just completely missing something, but it looks fine to me. The reason you only sent four ballistas is because um, whether you send four or a hundred thousand, uh, what's it called, uh, uh, in siege, you are only going to have four battalions that are basically going to get one shotted. So you only really need four because each one is going to take up its own battalion. So more than four, you're, there's no point. <clears throat> Five range heroes. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter that there's five range heroes. It's it's the best case scenario for him. Um, it just so happens that they're all range. But remember, Goblin is an army attack hero. So it's probably going to be his best bet regardless. It's fine. It's fine. It doesn't matter. It's fine. So your, your battalions are good. Your heroes on the wall are... That's not the wall. Oh, I guess technically it was, but you know what I mean. Your wall heroes are definitely better now. You have the best option of each one. Um, your comp, like I said, um, it needs a little work, but considering the kingdom that you're in, it's not bad at all. Like, yeah, it's it's not bad at all. Um, so, yeah, it's fine. It's fine. It looks good. It looks good. Um, yeah. Yeah. Team looks good here, too. Not bad. Okay. So, uh, yeah. So, I guess we'll go ahead and uh, get off of here now. Remember, your shield is up in 35 minutes. So, make sure that once I get off, you refresh it. Because uh, <laughs> uh, I don't know if maybe you want to refresh it right at midnight or what, what you might want to do. But, uh, yeah. Appreciate everybody for coming through. Um, the, everyone that donated, thank you so much. Um, I just put out a video not too long ago of the Madness in kingdom 757 so if you uh want to check that out it should have uploaded a couple hours ago also i uploaded a video on warpath maybe like two or so hours ago so it'll be a great way to support the channel if you go over here over there and show that video some love even if you don't play i highly appreciate it on uh, uh yeah tomorrow we will be streaming once again so make sure you tune in and uh, so also some more 757 action tomorrow so, quite a few things on the channel tomorrow. So, stay tuned. Uh, but, yeah. Appreciate you guys for coming through. And until later. Bye.